Hey guys, Sean again, Custom Offsets, Custom Offsets TV on the YouTube. Got another one of these matchups for you. This one is a little different tire size. That's why we wanted to show it to you. So this is gonna be a 20 inch by nine wide Mayhem. But what it's wrapped in is a 295-55R20. What that equates out to be is about 32.8. So it's still almost a 33 tall, but wide, it's only gonna be 11.6 wide. So a lot of times guys are running 33, 12 and a half. Well, this is basically a 33 by 11 and a half. So it's about an inch narrower. The reason somebody would run that is one, you're running on nine wide so that you don't have quite as much bubble. You still have decent sidewall protection for the wheel, but you don't have that big bubble of the 12 and a half wide. You get a little bit more of a squared up um, sidewall, especially if you were to go with a 10 wide, then it would really start to square that up. So this 11 and a half wide, the other reason is a lot of the Chevy Silverados and some of the ones, it depends on what setup you're doing, the wider it is, the more trimming you have to do. So guys might run a 295.55 on a 20 in order to narrow it up so that they don't have to do quite as much trimming. And then that 32.8 being just a tad shorter than a 33 might also be the difference between clearing and not clearing without doing trimming. So the sidewall on this one, 295.55 on that 20 is gonna be right about five and a half inches to the top of the lugs. And then from the bead to the tread seam is about four and a half inches right here. So that's gonna be about your sidewall height, about four and a half inches. So, you know, it's beefy enough to give you that off-road look and feel and not quite, you know, the, the street look but it's also not the big bubbly sidewall. So that is your matchup of a 295-55 R20 on a 20 by nine Mayhem. Peace.